even though I provided proof uh, of existence of my business website, the caseworker uh, said their system doesn't show that shows that domain name is not under uh, is not under my name. I want to show you live uh, so that there is no doubt uh, that the domain name is uh, under my company's registered under my company's name. Uh, I want to show from my email uh, that I had a contract um, with Tritel. Uh, initially, we had an understanding that they will register uh, simexpert.co.uk uh, in on behalf of us, and they will give us the system support. You are, you can anybody uh, any educated person can understand you can't change the date or any attachment which has been uh, correspondence to the email this is the hotmail uh, and it is my personal email if i uh, search uh, here with uh, the sales and markets marketing head of chaitel his name is mr jashim so i'm searching with his name and now all the email correspondence between him and me uh, will be shown here and if i go back to 2014 uh 2013 when initially uh the simexpert.co.uk was registered i can show you that i sent him an email requesting him to register the simexpert.co.uk on behalf of uh, my company uh the email is on 2013 and you can have patience with me you can see there is an email which is showing uh, on my sent item and this is dated 6 um, October 2013 and the subject line is saying rough contract and system development guideline and that email clearly shows we need to sit this week to discuss further on initiating our operations uh, Faisal who is my who was my previous uh, business partner uh, Faisal is expecting to be free from his job after 15th of October could you please try to help us by getting system ready by 10th of October so that I can start working on it so I requested him uh, to make uh, a system and website ready uh, till uh, uh, by 10th of October. If we uh, can look at the staff contract and system development, there is an attachment. If I download it and then if I can show you what was written inside this. Because caseworker might, might think that I have an understanding with uh, Chaitel and therefore uh, they have given me a contract later on just for visa purpose that's why i'm showing live from my email uh, what what is written in this attachment so contract between this 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 and then if you can see here what is written both of the companies have agreed on following conditions chaito will give system support um to tech mobi by helping them build a sim commission software named simexpert.co.uk if you uh, look at the headline Headline is contract between Chaitel and Techmobil Limited. There is, it is, it, it should be noted here that my company BF Consultant UK Limited was uh, registered on 11 November 2013, and this document is dated 10th October 2013. So it is one month prior to my business name registration with the company house. So yet we have not. We were actually thinking about different names. Uh, and then uh, and then in this initial stage we thought we will put our company's name, name tech movie so it is that's why it is uh, on the on the first line this report is to form partnership building ground between Chaitel communications and tech movie limited and you can see on the bracket waiting for registrations but later on on 11th november 2000 
third in when we finally decided our name we decided uh, our company name to be register on bf consulting Week limited and then now when we move back to the consultancy to the telecom sector with, and we are thinking of doing the technology based consultancy we have uh, changed our company name to not um, to tech movie we have changed our company name to movie tech so you can see on the uh, on this in a uh, rough contract that was written by me and sent by me to the uh, sales and uh, sales and marketing head of Chaitel. it is written Chaitel will give system support to tech movie which is like us movie tech by helping them build a sim commission software named simexpert.co.uk does it and also you can see this email was dated 10th october 2014 now if you look at who is um this is the website where actually everybody goes and check the uh, ownership of the domain name if you go there and you can see domain name simexpert.co.uk registrants you can get there. this is the employee of chaitel and if you look at the date nominate if you look at the date um of the registration you can see is 7 october 2013 this um, um email was um, this uh, website has, uh, was registered and you can see the date of my uh, email is 6 october 2013 and it was uh, uh, 6 october 2013 i have requested uh, chaitel to register simexpert.co.uk uh, to give us system support under this name and you can see on who is website this uh, domain name was registered on 7 october 2013 this clearly proves uh, that uh, uh, this uh, simexpert.co.uk was registered only to support us uh, by giving us system support and also if you look at the look, look at further uh, onto this contract you can see it is also there are some more points which was uh, initial understanding between uh, us and Chaitel. Later on, we have given uh, a formal legal framework of the contract by revising the initial contract of distributions, which was submitted to the Home Office and the caseworker have not looking to those uh, uh, contract to understand the simexpert.co.uk website was actually the ownership lies actually with Movie Tech Communication Limited.